moving on the fly. Today we're going to be looking at a new series called Swiping to Seattle. We'll be looking at all 30 NHL teams that are put up for the NHL expansion draft this coming year. We will start off with the Anaheim Ducks. In order to meet draft requirements, teams must expose at least two forwards, one D, who are under contract through 2021 to 2022 and have played either 40 games in 2020 to 2021 or have 70 games in the last two seasons. Of those highlighted players on the Anaheim Ducks include Adam Henrique, Jacob Silverberg, Ricard Raquel, Sonny Milano, Derek Grant, Troy Terry, and Nico Delorier. Other notable forwards include Sam Steele, who's a restricted free agent, Alexander Volkov, Isaac Ludenstrom, Max Jones, and Danton Heinen. All of these players are all restricted free agents, which means that they can re-sign with their, with their team or they can be picked by Seattle and be signed with all with full rights to them. Next up is the D. As you can see, there are six highlighted green players. These players meet the same requirements as the, as the forwards do, but like the D, they only have to expose one. These players include Cam Fowler, Hampus Lindholm, Josh Manson, Kevin Shattenkirk, Hayden Fleury, and Johan Larson. Other not notable D include Brandon Gooley, who did not meet the game's requirements this year, and Josh Mahura, who is a RFA. Finally, the goalies. The Anaheim Ducks only have two goalies that are, that are up for the NHL expansion draft, John Gibson and Anthony Stolarz. Now to start protecting players. The, the guarantees that will be protected include Jer Jacob Silverberg and Ricard Raquel. On the defense side, it is definitely going to be Cam Fowler, Hampus Lindholm, and in the net, it will definitely be John Gibson. From here, you can kind of determine whether it will be Adam Henrique, or Sonny Milano. I believe it will be Adam Henrique due to the leadership that he brings and Sonny Milano will not be selected by the Kraken due to his uh, youngness and lack of potential. You also have Troy Terry who will most likely be selected to be protected and Sam Steele, Alex, or, uh, Isaac Ludenstrom and Max Jones. Uh, on the defense side, it'll be between Josh Manson and Kevin Shattenkirk. I believe Josh Manson will outrun him due to the uh, potential that Manson has and Shattenkirk's aging. Uh. In terms of players at risk, I believe that Danton Heinen is majority at risk, as well as Kevin Shattenkirk and Hayden Fleury. Hayden Fleury's youngness and, and defensive talents is very attractive for the Kraken as a new team coming in and hopefully looking for a really good rebuild. Kevin Shattenkirk brings that leadership and that aging core that will really help them com combine to someday become a dynasty. And then Dan Heinen is a player that can become a really streaky guy if he finds his, the right chemistry with his line mates. Overall, I believe that the Kraken will select Danton Heinen from the Anaheim Ducks. And with that, the first player on the Seattle Kraken will be Danton Heinen. Thank you so much for watching. If you made it this far, please consider dropping a like, subscribing, leave a comment if you disagree or agree with me, and share with all your friends. Have a good day.